This is the presentation for approximation algorithms for tours of orientation varying view cones. Imagine an unmanned aerial vehicle or UAV equipped with a camera. We can model the area covered with a camera using view cones. And our goal is to capture footage of a target area or object. In order to do this, the UAV has to enter an inverted view cone located at the target area. In our previous work, we studied this problem for a large number of right angular cones. The solution yielded a polynomial time approximation algorithm for the cone TSPN problem. However, we did not consider what happens when the cones are allowed to tilt. This is the tilted cone TSPN problem and is the problem we study in this work. Our problem statement is the following. Given a collection of such inverted view cones, we will compute the shortest path that covers all of them. By considering the intersection of view cones with horizontal plane at a coverage height below the cone caps, we obtain the following approximation factor. As long as the cones do not touch the ground except for their apex points, this is a tight upper bound, and since the cones are not allowed to intersect with the ground, they can only be covered by a flying robot. Our practical implementation outperformed the apex tour that does not consider the view cones and simply covers them at the apex point. And in our simulations, we were able to get increasingly better tours the higher we chose our coverage. We also performed a set of experiments to further motivate this work. When covering watery fields like wild rice, sunlight reflection can be a big problem on the images. By carefully choosing our coverage view angles, we can reduce, almost eliminate, these sunlight specularities. To demonstrate this, we covered a large lake area with a number of different view angles. Those view angles were calculated according to the law of reflection for the current angle of the sun. Most UAV coverage today is being performed with only top-down views. So, Using the top-down views as baseline, we compared the amount of sunlight in the images using pixel intensities. The best angle views had almost five times less sunlight, which shows the importance of carefully selecting our view angles and that of the tilted cone TSPN problem. On the other hand, the worst angle views had almost six times more sunlight. This work was supported by two NSF grants and the MN Drive initiative.